Hi, it's Suzanne again, and today I'm just going to give you a quick update on what's going on with the um, thrift store bookcase built-ins. So um, I painted this one white. It's had a couple coats. It really needs, um, I would say, at least two more coats before it's done. Uh, but today the exciting thing is I went to Home Depot and I measured out my length, width, height, and had the trim cut at Home Depot. They don't miter the um, edges there. I have a miter saw in my garage that I'm going to use for that, but at least the trim is cut. So here we go. These pieces are going to basically go along the front, like so. And then, um, let's see, let me show you the shoe molding. Not the shoe molding, sorry, the baseboards. Whoa. They are going to go, well this one, I had two cut in case I messed one up. But um, this should fit nicely along the front, like this. So that's going to go like that. This little piece here is going to go on the edge here. Um, so it's going to go like around and connect back to the original baseboard of the wall to give it the built-in look. And then another piece of this will go like so. So I think you kind of get the idea of what I'm doing here. Um, a lot of carpenter glue is going to be required, but before I even attempt to do all the cutting, I just need to finish painting, and it's becoming quite a slog, so I just kind of want to get it done. Anyway, I just wanted to give you an update. It is definitely coming along. Thanks. So actually, this is not wax. It is, I believe, plexiglass that I melted um, and it did smell so I didn't do much because I don't want to die of the toxic fumes but there is a JFK 1964 commemor commemorative coin in the center and then there is also I'm trying to show you um, a coin in the bottom section you can't really see it too well it's made out of silver so one day maybe I will be able to chisel away at this and see what coin is underneath. But hey, at least for now, it is out of my bookcase.